Zach Dillard here at Brave Spring Training with Braves second round pick in 2016, Braves left-hander Kyle Muller. And this time last year, not in big league camp, yeah. on your way to A ball. Mm -hmm. You make it all the way up to double A. Yeah. You're in big league camp. How how far was that journey for you last year? It was awesome. I mean, it was definitely nice to be able to, you know, kind of show the Braves that, you know, their their investment is, is worthwhile. And, you know, after a rough kind of first full season, being able to bounce back like that, I mean, it's it's exactly what I was hoping for. I talked to multiple people that have said that you were the most improved player in this system. Mm -hmm. What was the biggest change for you? It was just kind of trying to figure who I am as a pitcher and, and as a player and, you know, trying to get my athleticism out in my delivery. And, I, you know, I got kind of caught up in all the mechanics and all that stuff. So I was like, look, you know, just let the athleticism take over and then try to be as explosive as possible. And that, I mean, that was the best thing that, for, that could happen for me. Did the Kyle Muller on draft day, Gatorade National Player of the Year, yeah. did he think it was going to be a much smoother ride, maybe a more linear path to where you are right now? Yeah, I mean, you obviously don't really plan for, you know, kind of setbacks like that. And I mean, I'm I'm actually really thankful that it happened because I, I got to really, you know, kind of see who I am as a as a pitcher, as a player and as a person. I mean, because that stuff's hard. And, you know, fortunately, going to that point, like baseball had been relatively easy. So being able to face some adversity that early in my career was was awesome. Talk a little bit about your off season okay. working with driveline, uh, the use of technology and in, yeah. in, in baseball and pitching, especially mm -hmm. right now. Uh, how, how has that helped you and how what was your offseason how was that what was that like yeah no it was awesome the guys up in uh, in Seattle are, are great I mean just the way they can interpret technology and, and use rap soto editronic cameras all that stuff and and show you how it best fits your game and, and you know kind of ways that you can use what you have to to attack people and they just kind of optimize you know your stuff at that time and I mean it's it's great what's the biggest takeaway for you how, how is that going to improve you most in 2019 so for me it was you know everything's fastball up curveball you know that's kind of the way the game's going and um, so maximizing my fastball spin efficiency to kind of have that late hop in the zone and then making sure my spin efficiency on my curveball is good to make sure it looks like it profiles well. I saw that you're also checking out your exit velocities on with the bat. Yeah. Uh, it, how, how, how much are you looking forward to you know you finally made it up double A last year get get back uh, mm -hmm. at the plate and getting some plate appearances now that you're in the higher minors. Man, I, I'm so excited. I saw something the other day that said they might get rid of the uh, the pitchers hitting and have a universal DH, which is kind of upsetting. But I mean, I'm I, I'm ready to go. I, I swung it a little bit this off season. I'm just I got to get that timing down because last year I, I didn't get a hit last year. So I'm I'm really looking forward to getting one this year. So you're scared about that. You you want to you're hoping they keep the DH long enough for you to make it up to the big leagues. 100. percent I mean, that's I, I feel like that's part of the game. And you know, like if it just shows how much of an all around baseball player you are. And for me, I. I think that that's an advantage as a pitcher if you can stay in and you can hit or you can bunt, you know, you can stay in the games longer, you can help yourself out. You know, they they use this guy, his name's Shohei Otani. He's, a, he's able to get some DH time yeah. in as well. Yeah, no, I mean, that, that'd that be pretty cool. I know Michael Lorenzen, he rakes too. Yeah. Uh, but I don't know. I, I, I got to get a hit first before we start talking <laughs> about DH and all that stuff. There's a couple guys in this system. Uh, Max Reed, yeah. uh, Joey Wentz, uh, mm -hmm. your, your you know draft classmate. Yeah. Uh, he could also hit big time mm -hmm. uh, prep player out of Kansas City. Are you the best hitting pitcher or are you going to in this system? Uh, see, it's hard to say because, one, I haven't gotten a hit yet. But I'd say in terms of power, I think I've got it.